Storage is a key component when shopping for parts to upgrade or build a new PC. The current surge of prices of graphics cards and RAMs have left buyers with a thought of looking for storage solutions that deliver impressive performance without breaking the bank. And this is exactly the direction WD is looking at with their latest WD Blue 3D NAND SATA SSD. Allow us to take you through with our review of this storage device and give you our recommendations. And just in case you're new to our channel or Facebook page, be sure to like that subscribe button or follow button to receive the latest updates and reviews from us. Special thanks to Western Digital Technologies Incorporated for sending this unit for our review. In order for us to render a fair review of this product, we subjected the SSD to several benchmark activities. As the SSD is positioned to budget-centric consumers, we thought of pitting this against Plexter M8VC 512GB, which is essentially comparable to WD Blue 3D NAND SATA SSD because of the published benchmark results and claims by both companies. For your reference, here are the specs of our test bed. And similar to our previous tests, we tested this SSD and its competitor isolated to the system or OS drive at 1024K sector size. Let me also tell you guys that we formatted the SSD at the NTFS file system at 1024K partition alignment. We used several industry-recommended benchmark applications to test its read and write speeds in a number of circumstances. As the benchmark results may just seem like a bunch of numbers, let me give you a brief explanation as to what each one does. And be sure to hit the pause button if you want to read more about the applications we used. With our benchmark using HD Tune Pro, the drive delivered an impressive transfer rate read speed of 426.2 megabytes per second at minimum and 453 megabytes per second at maximum. This is exactly better compared to Plexstor M8VC which only registered a 329 megabytes per second at minimum and 444.6 megabytes per second at maximum. However, the seeming advantage of former takes a bit of a toll on CPU usage. Notice that WD's SSD utilizes more CPU during the benchmark process. As for the random access benchmark using HD Tune Pro, WD's SSD delivered an acceptable performance of 27,804 IOPS or input output operations per second at 512 bytes and 490 IOPS at 1 megabyte. This is smaller by a small margin compared to Plexter M8VC. And now using Crystal Disk Benchmark, the SSD delivered close to 37 MB read speed on our benchmark. Write speed, on the other hand, is at par with the published benchmark result by WD. Obviously, when compared with Plexter M8VC, WD's SSD is significantly faster than its competitor. With ATTO Benchmark, we noticed that WD's SSD performs faster at 4 MB files or bigger. Its performance, however, is a little underwhelming, especially when compared to its competitor at smaller than 4 MB. Both write and read rates started to peak at more than 4 MB, which is more important in real-life usage. And lastly, with AS SSD, based on the result of our benchmark, WD Blue 3D NAND SSD reached 475 MB per second and 493.31 MB per second at sequential read and write operations accordingly. It boasts impressive performance at a very good price point. And now, for our verdict. When you're after SSD that's definitely a bang for your buck without sacrificing performance, WD Blue 3D NAND SSD is the storage to beat. At its category, it bested the performance of the published benchmark results which WD posted and even the competitor SSD we recently reviewed. Again, this has been Gian of Gadget Pilipinas. Thank you for watching our review.